To get started with ordering parts online requires configuring catalog buttons to appear on the order and revision screens and then vendor setup to match your shop to them. The linked vendor setup process allows defining each link between SE and a specific parts distributor. This makes it possible for the program to transmit the shop's account information to the vendor, then display pricing and availability from that parts distributor. Be sure to start from the product splash or home screen. Go to Configurations, Special Maintenance, Toggle Catalog Availability. This is the list of catalog options available. You may notice a choice is dimmed out. That's because they require a separate program to be installed alongside of SE. It can be installed by going to worldpack.com and downloading the speed dial application and installing it. Then the Worldpack button can be turned on and a linked vendor record set up for it. Toggle the appropriate buttons here to On and then click on Save. When you return to the Order or Revision screens, these selected catalog buttons will now be visible. Note, you must have the catalog button for a vendor catalog already toggled to On before entering Vendor Setup so that the required setup link option will also be listed. Configurations Vendor Setup is now used to enter the shop's credentials to identify itself to the vendor. Typically this is a username and password, although some vendor links require some additional entries. The basics of creating a vendor record are covered in the Configurations Vendor Setup video clip. Here we're going to take it a step further by configuring a vendor record to support two-way communications between SE and the vendor's catalog. This only has to be set up once per vendor catalog in use. Highlight the vendor you want to link to and choose Edit to open Edit Vendor dialog box. Choose Setup Link. If you have more than one vendor button enabled, the Link Type Selector dialog box will display several options. Pick the appropriate option for the distributor you are linking to. If the type you need is not listed here, it's because the button was not already turned on. Make your selection and click OK. The Setup Catalog Link dialog box displays. Enter the username, password, and any other required information. Click OK to save it. OK to exit the vendor record. Now repeat these steps to set up each vendor record per catalog button. Now go to an active order and click each catalog button to ensure that the setup work is correct. If you encounter an error message, please double check that your account credentials are valid and that they were entered correctly.